Hey, hey, what's up? It's your man, Abu America. Now, I'm here at uh, Team United. We're in the background training, you can see. So, uh, I actually got a question. So, I want to answer this question. And uh, it starts off, Assalamu alaikum, brother. I have a question for you since you've got some jujitsu experience. Wa alaikum salam wa rahmatullah. Uh, I'm about to start taking jujitsu classes, inshallah, and I was wondering if I should try to lose some weight as I'm doing it. I used to be a high school football player, so I had to put on some size, but mostly muscle. I'm about 5'8", 215 pounds, and around 15 to 20% body fat. Do you think the size will slow me down, or will it be an advantage? Jazakallah khair for taking the time to reading this. Okay. So you told me your age was 20, because I, I had to get that information if your age was 20. So you say you're 5'8", 215 pounds, and 20, 15 to 20% body fat at the age of 20 years old. Okay, so uh, going by the standard charts, the green area for someone your age is about 8 to 14% body fat. So you're actually, you're, you're, uh, you're 8.5 to 14% body fat. So you're actually over your BMI from a health and fitness aspect. Uh, 15 to 20 percent is, is, is good for someone my age, which is 41. So, uh, you know, you might want to cut down just from a health aspect. Uh, using a BMI chart, which I don't really like to use because according to BMI charts, I'm overweight, which is incorrect. Uh, your BMI is 32.7. Uh, obese is considered 30 percent. Now, since we can't do a physical assessment of yourself, what we have to do is we have to combine the two and say that, yeah, you should do some fat just from a fitness and a, and a health aspect. You know, uh, the combined 32.7 and you being 15 to 20% and what's ideal is 8.5 to 12.5% uh, body fat. I said 14.5, that's incorrect, sorry. Uh, you should probably try and drop some weight. Now, in terms of a jujitsu uh, aspect, uh, your body weight, you know what, you're gonna have to figure out your game first and foremost. Uh, body weight can have a pros and it can have cons. As a young man, you know, uh, it's probably more, it's a con because young guys, you've got a lot of energy, strong, long muscle endurance, so you can actually play the scramble game and, uh, you know, really be good at it and do it, you know, for quite a while. When you get older, you want to, you know, and, or just higher belt, you want to work on grip controls and pressure. So their weight really helps. My coach, you know, he's, uh, he's in the heavyweight category and man, his grips and controls and his pressure are just ridiculous. He doesn't have a need to scramble. He doesn't scramble. He just, you know, grips, controls and crush you. So it has its pros and its cons. You have to figure out your game. And when you figure out your game, learn how to use your weight. You know, as a heavy guy on the bottom, you do sweeps easy. Uh, as a heavy guy on the top, guys don't sweep you easy and it's easy to crush them. You know, um, body weight, it's all about the techniques that you master and then, you know, learning how to apply them. So weight doesn't really make a difference in that particular sense. You just got to find your game. Braulio Estima is a big guy. He's about as taller than I am and about the same weight. The guy has a crazy guard. I'd never think that a guy that tall with his body weight would play you know, guard. So I try to play the same thing as him. I try and play open guard. I'm just not as good as him at it. So um, get some training in. You say you're just starting, get some training in, watch videos, see, uh, see who is close to your body size and your body weight. This device was given to me by my coach. Find a guy close to your weight, your size, and watch his game and try and emulate it. And if it works for you, go with it. If not, keep looking, you know, and watch matches. Not just instructional DVDs, rely on your coach. Don't watch <laughs> instructional DVDs until you're like brown or up, you know, don't, don't even try it. Just watch matches, see what they're doing and try and uh, play those games. And uh, that's about the best I can give for you um, at this point in time, inshallah. All right, I hope that's been a benefit to you. I gotta get on the mat and get training. Us.